take us through the touchdown? Um, it was a good play. It was a, it was a choice play. Um, saw man coverage. I knew I could have beat the safety and uh, Strevy threw a great ball, and I just made a play when, it, when my number was called. What's been working for you the past two games? Um, I think it's just preparation. You know, Coach Middleton has done a great job in getting me acclimated to the tight end room. Um, so just investing, trusting him, trusting God, and just staying on course, really. Can you, go ahead. You, go. you mentioned Stradler. What do you think of his performance tonight? He's a baller. He's a game time player. Uh, I love his passion. Every time he gets on the field, you just feel you feel his presence. It's amazing, and that's what you want in a quarterback. And he's an amazing player. I just can't speak nothing but great things about him. What's been the transition for you from wide receiver to tight end? Like, can you kind of take us back to the beginning of that? And what's it been like to this point now? Um, yeah, at first, you know, when you when you first make the transition, it's, you think a little bit. Um, but like I say, I owe Coach Middleton a lot. You know, just him. Staying on me every single day, meetings every day, um, even the vets in our room, uh, Conklin, who's CJ, Wesco, Kenny. I ask these boys so many questions daily, and they never get annoyed. They always looking to help me, and I watch them a lot. And I tell them boys like they, I learn from them every single day. So it's really that tight end group as a whole. We're just brothers, and we just want to see everybody succeed. And I, like I said, I, without them, without Coach Middleton, I, I wouldn't be where I'm at right now. What's the biggest adjustment? Is it blocking? Is it like learning different routes? Or what was the biggest adjustment? I think for right now, the biggest adjustment is obviously blocking. It's a different task coming from receiver to blocking, blocking safeties mostly. And uh, in our offense, you gotta you gotta block. And um, so that's really been an adjustment. But it's all one two. You gotta want to do it. You gotta have a heart to do it. And um, you know, I got I got a big heart, and I'm just ready to learn, keep learning. I'm nowhere near where I want to be or where I, I can be, and I'm going to just keep working. Are you at the point where you enjoy having the chance to hit guys? Yeah, I definitely I definitely had to warm up to that. Um, first week, I, I got used to it. So now it's just just another day in the office every time I, we, we call a run now. What are you hoping to prove in the next two weeks of training camp? Um, just consistency. Um, Really, more consistently in the run game, um, just showing that I, you know, I can not just a pass catcher. I can do it all. Um, I can wh whatever this team needs me to do to help win, I will do because I feel like I can help this team. And um, that's really all, just consistency, being consistent, being the same guy every day. What was Coach's message to the team after tonight's game? Just love our heart. That was our brand of, of football. We started off slow in the first half. Um, had a had a good second half. Say play our football. You know we're we're the toughest team on the field. Come out and show it. And I feel like we did. And our resiliency was amazing. And we came out with the W.